Welcome to another beer review. Uh, you can call this one the Yeti beer review. Um, so today we have a uh, beer out of Louisiana, brewery out of Louisiana, Ghost in the Machine uh, by Parrish Brewing Company. Um, I believe it's a double IPA. Um, it does say ale on the front. Um, it is in a 12 ounce bottle. Um, it looks very, you can see it's definitely hazy in the bottle. Um, so kind of going into this blind. Um, I've never um, had this beer. Um, I don't know what the ABV is on it. I don't believe it says on the bottle anywhere. Um, nope, don't see it. So, um, so let's go ahead and crack it open and see what you got. I don't have any Parrish glasses, so we're going to have to use Humble C today from uh, out of uh, Santa Cruz. So, wow, uh, that looks like orange juice in a glass. Uh, I'm not sure if you guys can, looks like on camera, looks pretty, I'm sure it looks the same here. So, um, not much head on there um, at all, kind of this little film there on the top. So, um very very straw it looks like orange juice uh, it looks like orange juice in a glass that, uh, that's what it looks like and i can smell it from here as well so um let's go ahead and put her nose in it and see what she's got yeah i'm picking up um a lot of oranges a lot of citrus um maybe some grapefruit uh, some pithy some pithiness was a little bit of a grapefruit, orange, 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 maybe a little tangerine. That's all I smell is a lot of citrus, a lot of citrus in this beer. So um, I don't know the hops in this beer at all, but um, boy, it is loaded full of the citrus aroma um, as well. So let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and taste it. Cheers. Yeah, um, definitely taste follows the nose on this one. Um, a ton of citrus, ton of citrus notes. Um, maybe grapefruit, um, orange grapefruit, uh, maybe some lemon zest, um, some orange orange pithiness, grapefruit pithiness, lemon zest. Um, it's definitely very, very citrusy. Um, so, um, wow. Um, like I said, this is a... For, for for the most part too, it's um they said I'm the first beer of the day here. So uh let's I said but I'm I don't know if I'm real thirsty, dehydrated, but I can definitely like I said I wanna this um so um overall I'm very smooth. I'm a very smooth drinking. Um I am gonna guess this is seven, eight percent beer. Um, although it does say double, but then it says ale on the front, so I don't, I'm not sure what to believe on there, so I'm gonna have to look this one up. So, um, yeah, so, um, very good, good beer. Uh, a lot of hype around this beer. I've never had this beer before. Uh, it, 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 does, it kind of, it's, I mean, I'd say it fills the hype. Um, it is a very, very good, hazy, uh, New England hazy style IPA. So, um, like I said, I'm not sure. Like I said, once again, I'm not sure what hops are in this at all. Um, I'm, I'm gonna guess Citra. Um, probably loaded with Citra. Uh, this was what is the this was actually bottled on 3 6 and today is the 31st of March, so we're less than a month in. And it, it, it does taste it tastes fresh, uh, almost a little green. Um, it said it, it tastes fresh, they like did a lot of hops. Um, like a lot of fresh hops. That's all I can best way to describe that. So a little green, uh, but not 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 green that you can't drink it. Um, it's, it's still enjoyable here. So, um, if you have this beer, have had this beer in the past, um, leave me a note, um, comment at the bottom, and um, let me know what you think about it. But um, overall, I'd seek this beer out. Very very good beer. Uh, it's refreshing. Like I said, very citrus forward. Um, ton of citrus in this. So. Um, cheers all.